Hello and welcome back to the Rappy channel and back to Raptors Evolved Season 2, uh, Episode 3 of Raptors Evolved. Now I have actually changed the titling for this series just so it's it's confu- it's uh, not confusing, the opposite. Um, so it's clip- Merlin, have you- why have you just interrupted my intro? Right, might have to put this intro in the bloopers at the end. What a rude dog. Okay. Hello and welcome back to the Rampy channel. Welcome back to Raptors Evolve, Season 2, Episode 3. I believe I were probably going to be changing the title to make it clearer to everyone that this is, of course, Season 2 of Raptors Evolve. So welcome back. Hope you've been enjoying the series so far and you're having a fantastic day. Today I'm joined by, of course, Lightning McQueen and uh, my husky Merlin, who is behind me playing on his mat, biting a stick. Uh, so if you hear a dog bark in the background, uh, he might, that might be Merlin wanting some belly rubs because um, he likes to demand attention like that. But anyway, uh, while we have some peace and quiet quickly, I will tell you what we have planned for today's episode of Raptors Evolved. Um, actually, may as well... Yeah, you know what, let's set off towards that blue drop while I... Ooh, that was a... I always underestimate the speed of lightning. Lightning is a speedy, speedy boy. Um, yes. So in today's episode uh, of Raptors Evolved, we're going to be, first of all, hunting drops. Um, now, on the island, getting blueprints and drops is pretty much a nightmare. Unless you, like, farm the water caves over and over, which, uh, as you can probably imagine, I don't particularly want to do, considering all we have is a raptor. Uh, not not the strongest swimming mount. Um, so you can farm those, you could farm the Kano Island cave, you get you have a couple of options there. Uh, but generally, basically, the, 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 what I'm trying to say is the island is awful for blueprints and items. Now, obviously, we don't want any saddles. Well, apart from a raptor saddle, of course. So, um, we're looking for a raptor saddle. Oh, it's a micro raptor, wasn't it? Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Did not mean to do that. Okay, we're good. We're, oh, hello, fallen titanosaurus. Welcome, welcome to Scorched Earth. Um, so, yeah, basically, Scorched Earth drops are a lot, lot better. And uh, you can actually get good raptor saddle blueprints on here. Uh, but the main thing I'm looking for right now, to be honest, is a shotgun. Um, there we go, Mammoth Saddle BP. Not any use, but that's already something that you probably just wouldn't get in a blue drop on the island. Or like, you know, just not from a regular blue drop. Like, drops on Scorched Earth, Scorched Earth are buffed yeah, incredibly, basically, compared to the island. So for the first uh, half of this episode, I'm just going to hunt drops. I'm going to cut back to if we find anything good. Um, and in the second half, we are... Did I finish what? Sorry, I realise I go off on a tangent sometimes. So the main thing we are looking for is a shotgun for the Manticore. I think, don't think I managed to actually get that, spit those words out. Um, as while the Raptors will be doing DPS... Right, Micro Raptor... Oh, wow, is that... There's a lot of Micro Raptors after me. Okay, well, we're probably going to get Micro Raptored. At least I'm not... At least I don't have 0 0.1 health, so... You know, it's not the end of the world. Um, but yeah, we need a shotgun to do DPS to the Manticore because the Raptors are going to be struggling with torpidity. That's that's the reality of it. Oh, it's a green drop over there. I want to head, head over and check that one out. Um, so we will need to get a shotgun to do the main damage. So I, I'm pretty confident that I might do hunt some desert drops as well because I'm going to be heading out to the desert to kill some death worms with the raptor army. Um, I've still got the raptors uh, in, in their balls, healing up, uh, ready to take on some death worms. Um, and that's to get some black pearls to make some absorbent substrate, uh, with which is to make some gas masks, which we need for the Manticore. Um, so I think with that, all that being said, I'm going to go check out what's in this green drop. The good thing with the awesome spyglass, which I know some people might not like, but I personally love. You can see what's in this. Oh, ooh. Trank arrows, spyglass, yeah. Nah, not really, not really any use. Not really any use, to be honest. I, I saw the ring around it, and I was thinking, "Oh, come on, give us a raptor bl blueprint to start the start of the day." I've seen, pa I've already, I've collected a couple of green drops from going around, and I found like trike and parasaur saddles in there. Yet to find a raptor saddle. So hoping we. <laughs> and that is Merlin wanting some attention. So I'm gonna go get some drops. Give Merlin some drops, guys, and I'll be right back shortly. Welcome back. Now, this, my friends, is why Scorched Earth is just so... Uh, right, Ant, please, I'm explaining something here. What? Oh, hang on, it's got 20 health. Um, I haven't checked the... Sorry, I was planning on doing a big monologue here, but it's only got 20 health. Like, canteen is... Oh, 3 2 oh, There we go. There we go. There we go. 3 2, two. This is why Scorched Earth is so incredibly good. Scorched Earth drops, especially if you get them with a ring around it, are just 
I don't I don't know what the like loot quality is compared to the island. Now, obviously, keep in mind as I always have all my session. Um, is that an alpha. What is that? A one seventy? Okay, away from there. Okay, no, thank you. Not risking that. Um, yeah, so keep in mind I do play with loot quality two point zero. Now base is one point zero, so it's it is you know double as as uh, double as good. Some horrendous English right there, but yeah, um, it is it is better than what the base rate is. But even then, still, you guys saw how horrendous drops were on the island. Scorched Earth, the loot correct loot tables are just so much better. Um, that being said, free to, what's the juror on that? I mean, incredible juror, incredible weapon, incredible gun. Um, I'm. I don't really know why items over 298 are spawning. I suppose it's just, it was because of my loot quality setting that I've got on 2.0. That isn't actually something I intended to do. Um, I don't know if it, it... Maybe when I bring it back to the island, it will reset to 298. I'll have to look at that, because uh, obviously 298 is the weapon cap, if you didn't realise, on officials. Um, so I, I, I would have been happy to just play with weapon cap, honestly. I feel like it does make a bit more of a balanced game, but 322 is not that much over it, and maybe it'll reset. Um, aside from that, by the way, all I've picked up from these drops, I picked a whip up, because I, well, you know what, we can do with a whip, and then a Fawny Dragon blueprint, just to show you guys the type of things I have been getting. Obviously, I can drop that now, uh, because that's horrendous. I've also seen, like, things like, uh, Ascendant Racer saddles, like, Mastercraft, uh, Saber saddles. Haven't found anything Raptor related yet. No, no Raptor saddle, no Raptor blueprint. Um, and that's honestly the first... Oh, no. I found one primitive shotgun. Like, better, you know, a decent primitive, but in a purple drop. But, like, regular shotguns, especially for bosses, guys, are just absolutely useless. A pump action is what we need, and a pump action is what we've got. Um, and that's fantastic. That, that's honestly, like, that's a game changer. That really is. Especially for bosses like the Manticore, but, you know... I mean, I probably would have preferred a blueprint, honestly. Because, you know, just... Hopefully this doesn't happen, but for example, if I die in the Manticore boss, I'm not getting that back. We're not getting this weapon back. If I get a blueprint, you know, even if I have to go out of my way to make another one, it's expensive. I would have preferred a blueprint, but hopefully we'll still get a, we'll get a shotgun blueprint at some point. Because, you know, I'm going to need a shot. Oh, I've just read this. This is amazing for aberration. Oh my word, that's so good for aberration. So, so good. Okay, that is fantastic. Right, let me go. Let's, we'll go see what is in this. Ooh, there's a blue angle. Let's go this way. Because uh, there's a blue and green drop. I'm going to show you guys a couple of drops. Um, and then I'll probably hunt for raptor saddles for, I don't know, another sort of half an hour or so. I've been hunting drops for about 45 minutes now. Um, lightning does make it a lot easier, as to be said. But he's a bit, especially now I've clicked on this drop, he is quite over encumbered. Um, I, just, I, I don't think I showed you guys this. I think I meant to show you guys this last episode. So I did get a Ascendant Flamethrower blueprint and an Ascendant Mastercraft Chainsaw as well. I don't know. No, I think that was some uh, cave loot crate, right? I can't. I cannot remember, honestly. I know. It's bad of me. Um, but I got that when I was trying to get Lightning McQueen out of a drop, only then to realise I have to go to an obelisk. Um, but yeah, these are sort of like, you know, the weapon blueprints and I think armour. I think you can get pretty good flak blueprints on Scorched as well. I could be wrong on flak. I think you can get flak here, though. Um... You know, that, that, that's amazing. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, I don't know if I'll ever really make it. I mean, flamethrowers are pretty good on PvP. Not sure they have too much use outside of that. I mean, they're pretty cheap to make, though, honestly. They're not. 1.9k, I just meant paste actually is a bit annoying at the moment. Um, and I already do have a journeyman chainsaw back at base. But, I mean, that is a, that Mastercraft is pretty good, actually. If we put a crafting percentage skill on that, when we get back to base, actually... I'm gonna do. We're gonna do a metal farm. That's what we're gonna do on today's episode. To, fin to, to finish today's episode, after we've hopefully slayed some death worms, made some gas masks, um, I want to show. Uh, we want to test out our tech raptor farm. So that's what I want to do. That was a horrendous drop, by the way. Let's make our way to Red Obby to get this green drop, and uh, then I'm gonna see you guys back. I don't know. Like I said, I'm, oh, why? This is why. This is what. This is why you need a Jaboa. This is why, my friends, you need a Jaboa on Scorched Earth. Obviously, we know we I'm not allowed a Jaboa, but, um, yeah. This is a shame. All right, well, I'm just going to go AFK by this tree. The worst thing about Sandstorms is you literally just have to AF go AFK. There's nothing you can do. I'm going to go AFK, and I will catch you guys back probably... I don't know. I'm going to hunt drops within half an hour, see if we get anything, and if not, we're going to get on to killing some death worms, because I know that's what you guys are here for, really. Alright, I'll see you guys back in just a second. 
All right, guys, we are back. Um, we didn't find anything else in any of the drops. I went on for about another 20, 25 minutes. But honestly, I kind of got a bit bored of hunting drops. I, ooh, there we go. There we go. So we're, go we're looking for death worms now. Uh, there's loads of them around here. That's, that's good. That's good. That is very good. Uh, now, if you're wondering why we're killing death worms, I think I mentioned it earlier in the video, but I will just explain again. We need death worms. We need, sorry, we need black pearls to make absorbent substrate. Hmm. Alpha F worm, you say? Raptor army, you say? Lightning McQueen, you say? Let's go, Raptors! See you later, Alpha F worm. Oh my word. Oh my word. The raptors are too strong. <laughs> That's actually crazy. That is actually crazy. Okay, 20 death worm horns. <laughs> Alpha death worm trophy. Oh, I, sh I should have. Thingy it. Thingy did. Taxidermy did. That could have gone in the hall of fame. I'll take the trophy though, honestly. I'll take the trophy. That's a really cool addition. I Hey guys, uh, come on. You guys can let me spawn the taxi damn in, right? We need to get we need to update the Hall of Fame with all the creatures we've killed. And I will do it. Um I'm gonna drop the polymer again. I don't know who. Do you think that one of these raptors would have will have got any items from it? I don't know if Alpha's dropped black pearls or not. It's not looking good, is it? I'm guessing that they would it No, because I I already got the drops. They went on me, right? Alpha death worms are good for XP, man. Death worms. Killing alpha death worms are good for XP. Alright, well, I guess we're not getting any. Oh, hang on. That was Lightning McQueen's bug. Okay. Alright, well, I guess that death worm didn't drop anything else, which is kind of a shame. But it is what it is. It is what it is. Let's go find the next one. Um, so, yeah, these death worms drop black pearls. We make them into absorbent substrate, and then we make gas masks with that. So, that's what that's what we need to do. That's what we need to do. Death Worm can't even hit us. The Raptors... Raptors just might be the new meta. Raptors just might... Like, I mean... Nothing seems to be able to hit you. They attack so fast. Right, no. Leech Blood. No, that's not what we're looking for. We are not looking for Leech Blood. We're looking for Black Pearls. Come on. Some more Death Worms over there. There it is. It's already, already aggroed, I believe. So th this uh, just south of Greenob, by the way, guys. If you want, this is where you want to go to get death worms to spawn. There we go. <laughs> the death worms are just shocked. They don't know what to do. They do not know what to do with themselves. Amazing. Amazing content. Amazing content. Right, ancient. Did you get any? Oh, that was the one. No, you didn't. Useless death worms. So, um, if we, if what, well, if the, if we're getting such bad luck, guys, with the death worms, there are other options for us to get black pearls. Um, I mean, the best option is an aberration, really. But you know, we haven't unlocked aberration yet, so we can't do that. Um, but yeah, for now, on the island, we could try and kill some tusos. Uh, which which would work, but just, even just scout, scouting the island with just raptors in the water is it's just it's not a fun experience, um, and it's not something that I want to particularly do. Um, so I, I thought death worms would be our best bet. So I mean, we only need like twenty black pearls or even less. Let me just see what which death worm got it got at that time. This one, right? There we go. Ten black pearls. Okay, ten black pearls. Now, I think we need 16 absorbent substrate. So we need, it's two black pearls. We make, oh, that, that's honestly 10 black pearls is probably enough. Because you make it in a chem bench. So I think you need eight black pearls. But yeah, 10 is probably enough for now, honestly, for how many gas masks we need. Should we just, I don't know. 
don't think we have much more to do on on Scorch now. We, we have the artifacts. Uh, the Talons are in the obelisk, by the way. I've already left them at Blue Ob, if you're, uh, if you're wondering where they are. The artifacts are back on the island. So honestly, I think at this point, guys, we just need to... Um, we need to cry these these raptors up. I, I've got the black pearls, right? Yeah. And I think we need to return to the island. Um, because on the island, we've got some gas masks to make. Uh, we've got some tech raptors to fight. We've got some business to do on the island. Uh, you know, I need to fill the forges up, things like that. So just do some do some base maintenance, to be honest with you. Because that's all, that's all being put on the back burner. Obviously, since Songbird made the amazing Raptors Evolved base design that we now have, um, we've not had too much time to really get stuck into some of the stuff we need. I mean, luckily, we're having, we, we, when you're relying on Raptors, you don't need a crazy amount of stuff. Like, we're not making any high tech saddles or anything. Um, and the plan, by the way, is with the element. Hopefully, when we defeat the Alpha Manticore, is to make a replicator and a transmitter with it. Or maybe even a replicator and two transmitters. So we're going to need metal for that. So when we go back to the island, I'm going to see how good this Tech Raptor farm is going to be for metal. So I'm going to see you guys. Well, I'm going to go back towards Green Obelisk. And I'm going to see you guys back on the island in just a moment's time. Hello and welcome back. As you can see, we are back on the island. I've got my nice Manticore uh, helmet skin on, which I've got for killing the Alpha Deathworm. I mean... I think you should probably be getting that for uh, only... Oh, I've already unlocked Absorbent Substrate. Okay. Uh, for only killing the Manticore. But anyway, Absorbent. Hang on. Oh, it's in a chem bench. What am I on about? I'm on a... Being an idiot. Right, Absorbent Substrate. Oil. Oh, we haven't got any sap. Right, so we're going to have to make some sap taps, aren't we? Okay. Oh, oh man. Or I could alternatively... Hmm... S plus tree sap. Okay, so we've got... There's multiple options. We can, I think we make some sap taps and put them on the island. I can I can unlock the S plus tech one, but we don't have a replicator yet. Um, can only be crafted in S plus crafting station. Okay, we can craft that in Smithy. Just a tree sap tap. Okay. Ah. Rampy's messed up again, guys. Rampy is messed up again. Right, sap. How much metal do we have? We have enough for one. Do we have enough metal for two? We do. We do. Okay, I'm going to make two of these sap taps. Because we all... I mean, probably one would have been fine. I was thinking, like, we don't... I can't... There's no point making vegetable cakes. I was thinking, what else do I really need sap for? You know? So maybe... maybe I might have messed up a bit there. Anyway. Um, so I'm just going to go see... Oh, the green... Hang on, hang on. Hang on. I've got... You ready for this, guys? I, this, this is... This is what our hard work has earned. There it is. There it is. The Alpha Death Worm Trophy above the green ice. We're making some great progress in base. Some great, oh, we could, oh, we could move it here, really, actually. I don't know. I'm really looking forward to decorating this Hall of Heroes. We need to get a move on with it. Maybe we need to, uh, by the start of next episode, we're going to, actually, no, no, we need to end next. Next episode, by the way, is going to be the Manticore fights. Even if we have to do a lot of other stuff first, it's going to be the Manticore fight, 100%. Um, I've also got to make... We've got quite a lot to do, honestly. Um, where's my hat? I don't even have a hatchet on me. I said we need to farm up some charcoal. I need to get these forges going because... Okay, I've no idea what all this is. Candles? Ceiling lamps? And we need to ask Songbird on that one. Oh, I can put my blueprints in here as well. There we go. These are all the blueprints I've got so far. And I'm pretty sure apart from the odd one, they're all useless because I'm looking at like saddles and like cloth and hide. I, like, you know, the ghillie's all right. The ghillie and then we've got the chainsaw and now the flamethrower in there. Oh, and, and the desert cloth. Desert cloths could be useful. Could be useful for the, the, the heat. I probably don't need to have my, still be rocking my 90 fortitude. But it might be useful. Who knows? Who knows? So, I have got the chainsaw here that we got the other day. And some gas. So I believe in here, we do. We have some... Are these babies, though? Or are these fully grown? What do you reckon? Are these, are these babies or fully grown? They're babies. Okay. 
I don't believe it'll harvest babies. Okay, it does, but they barely, they barely get anything. All right, so we must have an adult one. I must have an adult one. It said it was fully grown, but... Sure, I have an adult one ready to be harvested. Are these all... Oh, no, these are... That's a tech raptor there. Um, maturity... No. No, these are all babies. Okay. All babies. I think they're all babies anyway. Are they not? They might not be babies, actually. I need to, we got nine... We got nine metal, but that was from the baby. We need to see how much we get from an adult. We need to see how much we get from... Is this a... Okay, that's, that's also a... Uh, a baby. Okay, let me... I think there's only one way we're going to do this. I'm going to throw out a couple of these babies, guys. Uh, let's let's get some of these tech raptors. Let, let's, do you know what? Let's get some of them. Tech raptors. There we go. There we go. If they're green, is that when they're fully grown? I don't know. I don't know. That's that, I, that was a mutation. Uh, oh, yeah. The, yeah, these are all... So the, these are green there. So I'm guessing they're fully grown. Let me just double check if we have any... No. No. These are all these are all raptors. Okay. I'm gonna put some of these out in the nursery uh, to grow up, guys. And then when they're ready, we're gonna uh, we're gonna have a bit of a baby slaughtering session. Some things that you only see and are only acceptable in rampy YouTube videos. Okay. So I will see you guys back in uh, in just a moment's time when uh, all these raptors have grown up. Be right. Back. All right, guys. It is now the evening, and uh, it's time to see what these, what this chainsaw can do with an adult tech raptor. What it can do with an adult tech raptor. So I'm going to actually bring these away from the group so they're not mate boosted because uh, I need to, you know, they don't need to see each other. They're going to the slaughterhouse. So let's take it to Lightning McQueen's backyard uh, to be slaughtered. You know, you got to die in a place of dignity. I don't have any shotgun shells, so I'm going to have to kill it with me. Hello? Raptor? Hello? Okay, well, um... That was interesting. I'm pretty sure this series just exists to show all of Ark's great, amazing, totally intended bug buggy features. Um... Yeah. Fantastic stuff. Nice one, Ark. Okay, I'm going to take another one and just assume that that was a bug because I'd just thrown it out and it needs to settle. I'm going to assume that was why. Let's just wait a minute. Ah, hang on, we've got, we got, we got to name this properly, guys. For those of you who have been around for a while know that we, we need to name our dinos Sacrifice to the Ark Gods. There we go. All right. Well, level 107, by the way, we can now get extra levels. Right, how much metal are we going to get? That's not bad at all. That is not bad. And some nice oil as well, by the way. Some nice oil. We will be... Oh, we're going to take that every day of the week. We are taking that every day of the week. It's lovely stuff. It really is. It really is. Right. Let's put the oil inside the chemistry bench. The electronics inside the fabricator. Even some element dust, which is uh, pretty useless at the moment. Until we get to extinction. But uh, but yeah, anyway. And I'm going to drop this. Let's go and let's go and see how my my forges actually, how quickly they smelt metal. But that, that is pretty good. Honestly, we can I, can... I can work with that. Let's just say that I can definitely work with that, guys. So clearly I just need to be raising tech raptor armies and that, I mean that it's it's the fastest way for me to smelt metal. There's there's no denying it. There is no denying it. Oh wow. It smells smells 20 at a time. <laughs> okay, this forge is very good. This forge is very good. Is that is it it's got it's a bit quicker than industrial, right? Maybe it's, it might just be the same speed as industrial. It's got 200 slots. Okay. That's good though. That's good. Oh, of course, the best thing about scrap metal is that that literally correlates to 100 ingots, doesn't it? 
Ah, uh, yeah, because there's no... It doesn't have, unlike raw metal. Okay, right. Well, I guess we'll just... Let's just take out another one of the... Oh, I need to go grab my bag quickly before it despawns. Quick rampy. Uh, and then we're going to go place the sap taps. And that's probably where we... So lightning will get another run out in today's episode. I'm going to have to run all the way to the redwood biome, which is going to be fantastic fun. I probably should have done that actually before we, the tech wrap. While the tech wraps are raising. That was a bit stupid of me. Because now we're going to have to wait for the sap to spawn. I might... I'll, I'll do some farming. I need to get... Actually, no, it's fine. I need to make shotgun bullets for the manticore. That's fine. We got lots of work to do. We got lots of work to do. Um, and we'll go, to, we'll go test how good the chainsaw is actually on trees in a minute. Is that a real tree? I can never know what's a real tree or not anymore. Because uh, thanks to Songbird's lovely artistic design. 120 scrap metal that time. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Right. It's a real tree? It's not a real tree. How long does the bag have? Half an hour. Okay. Let's go find a genuine real tree. And see how much wood I get from. It's a bit dark here, isn't it? On the a bit dark on this morning. Days from one day one hundred and twenty three on the island. Okay. Ooh, yeah. All right. Because we need to get charcoal smelting. I don't know whether I might. There's a chance I might mind wipe into full weight, guys. I think if I can make a mind wipe, what I'm going to do is mind wipe into full weight and farm up some charcoal. I normally hate doing this boring stuff with you guys. Like, I hate showing the kind of grindy farming, but hey, if you guys enjoy seeing it, let me know. I'm happy to, I'm happy to include it. Or maybe we could include it on, like, the VODs channel or something. Okay, so let's see if we have a mind wipe. I don't think we do. What do we need for one? Like, I feel like... Okay, rare flowers and mushrooms. We have... Consumables, crafted foods, mind wipe. We have flowers and mushrooms. Cooked prime meat. Hang on, we can get we can get all this, guys. We can get all this. I'm sure we can. Oh, I don't think I have any stim berries growing yet. That might be my one weakness. I should probably get some stim berries growing. Okay. Because so I think if we mind wipe, go full weight, we can then fill the forges up. Let me go get my bag. Let me... Yeah, we need to mind wipe and go full weight, I think. That's what we need to do. But first, I should probably go place those sap taps. So let's just... Let's grab this. Let's grab the metal. Let's get all that off my body. Then we're going to go get lightning and go place the sap taps down. Then we'll think about mind wiping for full weight. I don't know how long. I, I thought this was going to be a short episode, but it might not be. It might not be. Who knows what the final run time is going to be. Uh, put the... Yeah, there we go. There we go. Maybe we'll save the mind wiping for the next episode because I think I've rambled enough. In the meantime, anyway, let's go and uh, get, let's get lightning and go place... Do I have enough weight? Ooh, let's put those black pearls back in. Honestly, for 10 black pearls, did we need to kill the death worms? Probably not. I probably could have, honestly, in the end, just killed one of those um, torpor things. A Eurypterids. That probably would have been the most simple way, honestly, to get 10 black pearls. But it's fine. It's absolutely fine. Um, sap taps away 8. I don't need 25 grapples. I'm going to drop off some of this gear so that lightning's a bit quicker. And then we need to have a... Before Aberration, guys, it's probably going to be a mutation session, honestly. I feel like we need to have a mutation session. Uh, do I need a net gun? Am I out of nets? Yeah, I'm out of nets. There's no point carrying it, though. There is no point carrying it. I don't need those. Don't need those. There we go. Right, let's go with that. Let's go with that. Right. I'm going to get lightning, guys. We're going to go place those sap taps down together, and then that might be it for the... Ooh, do we make a cliff platform? tree platform what do we need for a tree rock oh these are a, a wooden tree platform uh i don't think we have the resources for that 600 so many places a lot guys i'm not gonna lie i don't know if i want to use my, all my metal and stuff for that a lot of wood as well the stone one is probably the best one to do but we need to go to aberration first 
the glass one. All oh, this is just tech, a tech tree platform. All right, do you know what? We're just going to do it the the poverty way for now. And, uh, and we're going to have, we're just going to place some, some saps on a tree. So where's lightning? We've got a nice, fl long, fun journey ahead of us, lightning. Oh, there we go. Use that exit. Because me and you, mate, are off to the redwood biome. Fun times, I know. Right, lightning. I think we're going to go for a level and wait on old lightning, you know, actually. In fact, you could do he Poor lightning is a hungry man. I've, uh, I've just realized I can probably drop. I didn't drop off half the stuff I needed to. Right. I'm going to go drop off uh, this shotgun, some more grapples and stuff in my storage box, guys. <laughs> I'm going to see you back when we're in the uh, when we're in the redwoods. So I will. Uh, I'm going to be right back, guys. Be right back. Right. Hello and welcome back to the redwoods. Now, we just need somewhere. To place these sap taps. Oh. What's that? I got mass tax. Okay. It's fun. Hang on. What did you steal? What did you steal from me, mate? My cooked meat. Cheeky bugger. All right. Sap taps. Oh, there we go. We don't even need to grapple up. All right. Well, that's simple. They're placed. Well, we're farming and we're farming. Oh, it's kind of... Okay. All good. All good. Fantastic work. Okay, well, that is very good stuff. All right, well, with that done, um, I'm going to head back to base. But this is going to be the end of today's episode of Raptors Evolved, guys. Uh, I am at my brother's wedding this weekend, so it'll be a busy weekend for Rampy. But I'm going to make sure you guys have got a video on scheduled to watch. So don't you worry, the finale for Raptors... No, no, sorry, for the, for, yeah, well, the finale for Scorched Earth of the Alpha Manticore boss fight is going to be coming this weekend so together we're going to get off the desert map and hopefully ascend and then get into aberration so yeah finale comes on sunday uh we're going to start off i'll show you with me farming the shotgun bullets and then we will be taking on the alpha manticore guys so i hope you have a fantastic rest of your day guys and i will see you on friday or saturday not not quite decided yet for the next episode of raptors evolved take care guys bye bye for now